In this part of the Canon EF Lens 101 series, we're going to cover macro lenses, lenses that help make little details seem big. So what is macro photography? Macro photography is all about photographing objects that are really close to the lens. See, at the minimum focusing distance, most lenses won't let you focus on things that are just inches away from the lens. But special macro lenses, like Canon's EF-S 60mm or EF 100mm, are designed to let you get really close. And they're designed to be super sharp when you do focus close. Macro photography is great for photographing small objects, like flowers, insects, and jewelry. For example, if you wanted to get really close to show off the detail on a flower, a macro lens works great. Or let's say you wanted to photograph shells on the beach. Not only do macro lenses get you super close to show off all the intricate details and patterns on the shells, but they also do a great job of creating that soft, blurry background that really helps those patterns and details stand out. So let's talk about some tips on using macro. First thing is that focus is really important you want to carefully put the sharpest focus on one part of your subject, like the face of an insect. So take the time to ensure that your sharpest focus is where you want it. Next, the lens apertures you use can be really important. Let's say you're shooting a flower at a wide open f-stop, like f2.8. Even though you're focusing on one part of the flower, not only does the background become out of focus, but the rest of the flower itself can quickly become out of focus and blurry too. So you may need to use an even smaller lens opening, like f11, or even higher to bring more of the flower into focus. Most Canon macro lenses will focus to what's called life-size magnification. In layman's terms, this means you can fill the frame with the subject the size of a US quarter coin. Now here's one more tip. Most macro lenses will focus out to infinity. So even though macro lenses are designed for close-up work, they're also great for other types of photography, especially portraits. Canon's 100mm and 180mm macro lenses are favorites among some of the portrait photographers out there. As for lenses, Canon has over a half dozen different macro lenses with different focal lengths depending on just how close you want to get to your subjects. There are even macro lenses with built-in LED illumination for lighting close-up subjects. And for those of you that want to get into macro even deeper, make sure you look at the Canon MPE 65mm which lets you photograph a subject at up to five times its normal life size. At magnifications like that, you can fill the frame with a grain of rice. Next up in the series, we're going to switch gears, and we're going to go really wide with the unique perspective of a fisheye lens.